All right, here we got Phil Diaz from Core Racing GT1. Hey, hey, Phil, how's it going there in the car? Uh, pretty good. After uh, three hours, just trying to stay awake. It's a long stint for anybody. So you got, I see you got some uh, left side damage. Did you have a run in with the wall or someone else? Uh, through the final chicane, I clipped the tire just barely with the left front, and it just threw. It's kind of like a little lag hit or something. It just threw me around into the uh, wall on the uh, right side. So you've been battling for most of the stint to catch up to the number 10 car of LFSLA. Uh, are you making any pro? Are you making any progress there? Uh, just from what I've heard from my teammate, uh, I've been caught up about 30 seconds the past uh, two stints. Slow but steady progress, I guess. Yeah, with that mistake also. That's all you can really hope for when the. Uh, the other team doesn't have any problems. Yeah. I just but heard you still your got wheel. Uh, Go ahead, sorry. That's right. Uh, I just heard your wheel uh, cranking a little bit as you were going through that chicane. Uh, what uh, wheel have you got? Uh, G25. Sim Racer's tool of choice. Very good. So, so um, my third one. When you're <laughs> your third one, really. Yeah, and the shifter's broken also. Yikes. Now, now have you paid for all three years, or they giving you free ones to... Nah, no, just had to pay for the shipping. Yeah. Um, after this this uh, stint, after these three in a row, are you coming back for any more uh, later on, or are you done? Yeah, I got another one in about uh, um, two hours, uh, 2 a.m. So you you planning to to grab a nap? Or are you gonna stay up for the rest of the race? No, I still haven't decided. I'll sit here and listen to music. If I fall asleep, I fall asleep. <laughs> so when once you're done, it'll be uh, Corey Green and 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 Ariel uh, Chidini finishing it off, or is Nolan Scott coming back? Uh, no one should be back around four, probably about four fifteen. Probably when we'll be, he'll be coming back in. And four fifteen your time would be uh, nine fifteen in GMT U UTC time. UTC, yes. Uh, given the 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 troubles that you've had with the disconnects and your spot now in eleventh place, what's the best best finish that you think you guys can? Uh, if no one else has problems, I'm going to say maybe a seventh, maybe. Let's push it. Well, I wish you guys the best of luck, obviously, being a teammate of yours, but uh, it should be interesting to see what the next uh, ten hours or so bring. No. Yeah, it's ten hours left, anything can happen. Now here's a question. Um, do you think you'd be able to give us, uh, as you go around the lap, uh, kind of a talk about how you're going around the lap? I don't know about that. That's a lot of concentration for for, 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 for a guy who's uh, three hours into his stint here. And how how hard is it to keep your concentration over the three hours? Uh, it's not that hard. Got some Cheez-Its, Propel. <laughs> Got a TV to my right. That's pretty much it. Are you by any uh, and and are you by any chance watching the the watching the watching the 24 hour race from from Daytona? Yeah, it was. Right now, it has some Irwindale oval racing on at the moment. Uh, yeah, it's just going around in circles, and I might be American, <laughs> but it does get boring. When you're in a car for three hours and then you look over and these guys are going in circles. <laughs> <laughs>
Alright, well I know you have to pit soon, so I'll put you back over to your uh, team channel and we will get back to the race with uh, the rest of the race. Right. Thanks for your time, Phil. Good luck with the rest of the race, mate. Thank you. Thanks for having me.